G'day everyone, Ian Fegan here, also known as Professor Shoelace. Now I'm a bit biased towards my own Ian knot, the world's fastest shoelace knot, but I guess I can give some reasonable instructions on how to tie regular shoelace knots as well. Let's begin with the standard shoelace knot. I've got a set up on a regular shoe that's ready to tie, and we'll begin with a left over right starting knot. So that's the left end feeding over the right end, feeding the part through the middle and pulling tight. Now we create a right hand loop. I actually use the left finger as a support. Create the loop and pinch it at the bottom. Run the left end around the back of the loop, right near the base. And then we want to feed this part of the left end through the hole that we have created by doing that wrap around. That forms a new loop on the right hand side. We've already got the loop on the left. Pull both loops to form the bow. Again, create the right loop, pinch it tight at the bottom, run the left end around the base of that loop and see where my fingertip is emerging there. That's a good thing to push this loop or this loose part against that and it will naturally feed through the hole forming the loops pull tight and you've got your finished knot. Now left handed people will find it more natural to do the movements in reverse so create a loop on the left hand side run the right loop around the back and feed through but if you do exactly what I did then, notice how I've got a bow that's sitting along the shoe instead of across the shoe. That's an unbalanced granny knot, and it's because we didn't retie the starting knot. In order for a knot to be balanced and to stay secure, both stages of the knot need to be done in harmony. So now I'm doing a right over left starting knot instead of my usual left over right. Then I can safely do all the rest in reverse. Left loop, right end around the back of the left, push through and pull tight. And we've got a regular knot that stays secure. So if you want more information about the standard shoelace knot, as well as about a dozen other knots, including the granny knot that comes undone, you can go to Ian's shoelace site.